Hey guys, at BV Madsen here, and uh, just wanna let you in on uh, some observations that I've made with the paint. Now, most of you know, um, painted most of the uh, parts with this Rust-Oleum Professional, high performance enamel. I loved the way that the paint uh, went on, it sprays beautifully, uh, fantastic, but it reacts really bad with the clear. So I have the Rust-Oleum, custom lacquer clear that I put on it. And uh, just look at what happened to one of these parts. As soon as I started putting the clear on, it started to crackle. There was definitely a really serious chemical reaction that was happening and I just stopped right there, went to the grinding wheel and brought the part back down to bare metal. So while that's pretty sad, so i um, gonna make a pivot, gotta use VHT. VHT roll bar and chassis is the paint I'm moving forward with. I'm actually going to repaint some of the parts, uh, the ones that are going to get a lot of, you know, wear and tear. I'm going to go with this. Now, I have not had a problem using this clear with the VHT. Okay, guys. So in a previous video, I said Rust-Oleum was uh, this high performance enamel was what I was going to go with. Changing it up, going straight with the VHT. Um, not that big of a price difference, honestly, maybe a couple of bucks, but this is going to work way, way better for what we're doing. So guys, if you're using paint, got to pick the right paint. This stuff is out. <laughs> All right. The high performance enamel is out. I'm going with VHT on everything and every bike uh, that I work on moving forward. And again, I love this clear. This clear works really well. It uh, polishes up really, really nice or buffs out rather really, really nice, um, but it works well with the VHT. So, um, really bummed because I've got like six cans of this high performance enamel. So I'll find another use for that some other time. But I just want to let you guys know that I wanted to uh, let you guys know that uh, um, that stuff makes that stuff bubble up. <laughs> and it's really, really bad. So um, VHT all the way. And here you can see we've just uh, repainted some parts with VHT. Um, yeah, was hoping to put the front end a little bit more together today, but that's not going to happen. Um, these parts I painted with VHT and the clear, they came out great. I had painted this with the Rust-Oleum, the high-performance enamel, and that's what bubbled up so terribly, terribly wrong. So, you know, just transparency, let you guys know, go with the VHT. That's going to work best for you. If you guys enjoy the videos, please subscribe. Also, give a like, thumbs up those videos that you enjoy. Uh, also, follow along Instagram and Twitter. Uh, hopefully, bust out some videos today. I'm waiting on paint to dry, though, so going to have to pivot. Might have to work on something else. Not sure what we're going to do. Um, definitely a slowdown in the process today.